<coughs> Alright guys, welcome back to some more The Walking Dead. Now in the last episode, it was the episode 10 special and things were pretty crazy. Things were pretty crazy guys. Um we Is completed there any way to get episode it? two. Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. We uh, can't really afford to do that. Nah, now we need a lot, man. This seems like a safe area. All this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. Clem repping the Brooklyn hood. Even the she's not from. Why don't you and I go look around? Brooklyn, she's from Savannah. Yeah, everyone else relax. Clem, stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, hon. Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? I haven't crossed my mind. Alright, so this episode might take a while as well. Seeing as, you know... <coughs> um... It's the longest episode in the series. <laughs> episode 3. Whoa. Somebody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit. Think they're gone? I hope so. But this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard on. Okay, 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 yeah, okay, yeah. I like this music, it's really nice. Shit, broken. There's gotta be a better way to do this. of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kenny's got us headed. I'll take this to Kaja for Duck. Okay, is there anything else we can pick up here? Um, I'm just chatting to someone, guys. I'm quite happy, actually. Got some good news. Nothing. Let's open up all these. Now you'd take the monkey wrench, you just would.
Um, We gotta look him over. Yeah. That walk looks real scary. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. We found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. This horse will take us right to Savannah. A hundred tons of steel. Put a thousand walkers between right, us I think and we'll the ocean. The episode we don't once have to I, uh, get the train to I can't work. Believe it. <clears throat> Just have to figure out how to get it started. I'm sure we can figure it out. How tough could it be? Doug would have known, but we'll figure it out. That's the spirit. Ben, if you could keep an eye on the girls and Duck, I'd appreciate it. Sense of these controls. Man, this could be exactly what we need. Uh. Right. I have no idea what to do with these. A bunch of maps about Georgia's cities. Nothing about the train. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Oh, a pencil. <coughs> um. We got a problem. What? We still got the rest of the train attached to us back there. Shit. I tried to yank the pin out, but it won't budge. Well, we ain't going anywhere until it does. Right, let's yank this out then first. Jesus! Oh my! Holy. Dude, I just jumped out of my skin. Nah, don't do that, man. Don't do that. Jesus, man. Whoa. Whoa. Nah. Nah. Oh, my. <clears throat> that woke me right up. <laughs> to kill him. Is 
Isn't it this? Right, I think it's on the other side of this actually. Definitely pry this thing free if I can break it loose first. It's what? Tough. We need a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. There's got to be a better way to do this. We need How? a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot How the... before I can pry anything free. Well, that's annoying. about the train. Hey, kid. What's up? God, we need some help getting this train going. People take notes, right, when working on stuff like this? Uh, we're smart guys. We can figure it out. I'll get back to it. Me too. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. I have no idea what to do with these. Ugh. I don't know, guys. Bike remover. <clears throat> I has to do it, right? Saw the little um, saving icon, I'm guessing. That's it. That has to be it, dude. Bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. Unbelievable. There's got to be a better way to do this. I mean, if you don't have the notepad, how do you do it? He's probably fighting whatever's in it. Exactly. Has Clementine said anything to you about Doug or Duck or anything? I'm worried about her. No. <laughs> that little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. Hmm. Poor Doug. God, where did yesterday go? 
I'll right, give him the wall. You were standing right there. Are you doing okay? I'm fine. It's just such a waste. He was a good guy. I liked him very much. He'd spent some time in Belgium. Where your family's from. Yes. Even further away now. Would you have left Lily back there? On the side of the road like that? Yes, Lee. Yeah? We have to have lines. Yes, I would have left her. Okay, then. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. You know, leaving Lily right. on the side of the road. What is he doing? He's put his mind to figuring out the train. I don't agree. Same thing, sort of. I found some instructions, but I can't read them. Oh. Well, I'm sure someone can help you. Does Clementine have a pencil? There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. We found a notebook that we think might have had some starter directions on it, but the page is missing. Well, I'm sure you guys will figure it out. Here, found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? That's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I Maybe don't. Maybe we have to take the right. notepad and give it to Clementine. See, because on the series I watched, um, he had the pencil anyway. I don't have no pencil, guys. I don't have no pencil. And this is proving to be tricky. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Yep, same old. Pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Hey, Ken. What's up? I don't know about leaving Lily back there. Abandoning someone on the side of the road. It's the same as murder. Don't worry about it. We just would have had to deal with her eventually. You want to talk about that? I'm really sorry, Kenny. Nobody deserves this. There's nothing to talk about. You heard Cat. He could be fine. We probably shouldn't ignore it. Nobody's ignoring nothing. I'm not worried. You shouldn't be either. God, we need some help getting this train going. People take notes, right, when working on stuff like this? Uh, we're smart guys. We can figure it out. All right, then. Yep. I'm going to shoot him. I can't get him.
And there's not a pencil in sight. That is so sad. That is so sad. It's in pretty good shape for a wreck. Hey, sweet pea. You okay out here? I don't think Doc feels good. Uh, me neither. Here, I found these. If Doc's up for it. Thank you, that's very thoughtful. He isn't fussy, you know. What? Most kids, they're really fussy about what they'll eat. Hate vegetables, that kind of thing. Not Doc, huh? No. The most trouble I ever have is making him use a fork. Thank you, Lee. Sure. Yeah, see, I'm not sure, guys. To progress in the game, we need to find that pencil. Nothing about the train. It's a bunch of papers. Nothing about the train. Nothing about the train. Dude, there's a pencil underneath that. Hey, Kent. What's up? God, we need some help getting this train going. People take notes, right, when working on stuff like this? Uh, we're smart guys. We can figure it out. Forget this. Wait, is the RV still? No. No way. Are you kidding me? It was not that easy, was it? Guys.
I think it was just that easy. I think it was just that easy. Take me there. We may think we're uh, com coming to the end of this game, but we're not. We are not. Perfect. You can read it now? Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. But down, down, up, 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 down, up. Down. <laughs> That's for number six. Down, down, up, 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 down, down. Right, down, down, up. 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 Down, up. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up! So far, so good. Number five, it's sideways. Yeah. Yeah. Now we're talking. Nine. Left it. There was another one. We have to go out here then. Yeah, left and then right, so left. Alright. Oh baby. Oh, we're golden. Yeah we are. Golden. Man, feels good. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mum, let's see if she'll move. Mom, look. I got the train to work. Damn it. Of course, we're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck and get us unstuck? Yeah. Mom, look. Hey, Kenny, we're loose. You 
touch any of my stuff. I took the map of the train once. That's fine, you can have that. Really? I guess it's no worse for wear. Call Thanks for Chuck. Too. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. That your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab? Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. You're still kind of freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warmed to me right quick in direct sunlight. You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, then <laughs> too. Betty, you skinny fat boy. You have candy. Boy, I got the last piece you got on me. Figures. <coughs> you bet, Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <laughs> <coughs> oh, my God. I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on the... Stay with us. We'd like the company. So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. And find anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. Come on, Clementine. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. We can keep going if you want. Damn right I won't. That's what we're doing. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get on, Cat. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. We're moving, baby. He knows it. He knows it. His son. His son's gonna turn, man. Look at that. Come on. I know that. Like Larry said, first thing he'll do is sink his teeth in his mom's face. No, I'm not being funny, but they are moving quite fast. <laughs> you gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. It is. 
daughter's something else. She's not. She's a survivor. Takes after her dad, looks like. Lee. Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What, sir? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. We'll do this bit and then we'll, um... Stop the train. Kenny. What? Ken. What the hell's that? Your son's blood. Get out of here, Lee. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. I'm sorry. I shouldn't talk like that right now. Go back there and tell my wife everything will be fine. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. You're in denial. And you've given up on Duck, on everyone. Stop it, goddammit. Fuck you, Lee. You're gonna listen. Or what? Calm down and... How the fuck do you calm down after a day like today? By talking to your friend. How many sons are you gonna let die? Shut your mouth! I didn't want to... Not to I told Kaja I'd get you to stop this and you bet your ass I'm gonna... I've had your back. Don't make me fucking regret it. You want to hurt people because you're afraid. Losing duck ain't enough for you. Because you're fucking lose everything acting like this. I'll fucking kill you before I let that happen. That could affect the end of the game. That could affect the end of the game. No, oh, god damn it. I hope it doesn't. I hope not. You know. Again, it's. I think it's time. The boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. What do you need? I... I... Katja. It's time to... Oh, this is not possible. What are we going to do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. Is there a way to like catch what, if, what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... Come on, Cat. If you think of one, 
You let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. I'll do it. No, it should be a parent. No parent should have to do something like this. He's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us some more. No, we're saving Catch it. Of course. Yes. Yes, that's good. We're saving Catch man. Huh? I'm happy Catch is being saved. sure he doesn't come back. Oh. Oh. Look, Clem. Things are... What the... No! What Bit, the hell? Take I was doing into it. the train. Go. It'll be fine. I was doing it. What the... F nah. I was doing it. This is what I mean. I was... Sh there's no possible way, like... There's actually... Get! Get! Gotcha! Why? Cat! Honey! Oh, fucking God! <laughs> oh my God! I... I... Ah, oh, man. Holy crap.
Yes. Okay. What are you thinking about? What Chuck said. What Chuck said? That what happened to Duck would happen to me. The fuck he did? Swear. Sorry. Okay. You took some sense into it. Don't be mad. How can you not be mad about that? Hey. How you doing? I don't care what reasons you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Go she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. If y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? I figure it out. Well, get to figuring, because it'll be on top of us before you know it. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. I'm not a barber. It ain't gotta be styled. Jesus. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before Walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. Okay. Explain to... I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. Seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. I shot the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Where are you headed? Uh, that one. I mean, when we get to Savannah. You got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there, about Ooh. whether or not you folks want company. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. I'm sorry to hear that. No one to blame. Be safe up here. You betcha. Well, it's gonna be the end of the episode. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. I'll see you all soon.